Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for March 1st, 2nd, and 3rd for my Aquariuses. Hello, Aquariuses. How are you all? Okay, hope everything is going well for you. Now, as always, since this is the shorter reading, I'm just using my Doreen Virtue Angel Tarot cards. I have prayed, meditated, and infused with Reiki energy, and this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate with you. Take what you like, leave the rest. So two subjects. Okay, one is the drawing. Now, the only way you can sign up for that is to go to the community page. And even though I love the comments and I want to respond to the comments so much, but in order to keep this nice and clean, I can only give numbers. Okay, so just know that when I read it, I'm going, oh, thank you. Thank you so much because we reached the 5,000. So that's the one thing. The other thing is, now this is next week. This is the, the fifth and sixth. Now, to, I, more, I am more with the 5th, but, you know, there's some that are saying it's the 6th, so it's probably going to be in that evening time, that night time from the 5th to the 6th, that um, Mercury goes retrograde, and we did talk about that. But then, on the 6th, there is a new moon. And then, on the 6th, Uranus goes into Taurus. Now, that's, you know, Uranus brings about changes. It's weird types of changes. But... A lot of this, so there's going to be a lot of energy that's going on. Now, what does that mean for you, Aquariuses? I am only thinking that this is going to be positive changes, but yet it's. I feel like it's going to be kind of, um, it's going to be that rough change because, you know, we've talked about this, you're not going to be necessarily used to it, okay? But, you know, you're not, you, you're, what I'm saying is you're not, you're not going to necessarily be used to having positive change. Because yes, you, you've had a lot. You've had a lot. But Uranus doesn't just stop and say, oh, I'm going that way or I'm going into Taurus, you know, right on the 6th. It's not the light switch that we talk about. It has been transitioning into, you know, Taurus. So that's where a lot of this change is coming from. Okay, so let's see now for Aquarius, but for the weekend. Let's see what happens for the weekend. Let's see, the weekend, the weekend, the weekend. Weekend, weekend, weekend. Aquariuses. Okay, let's cut and see. And my glasses. Okay. First card, all, these are all face down, so let's see what they are. The Knight of Earth. Earth, of course, our um, Capricorn, our Taurus, and our Virgo energy money, things you can touch, concrete things, okay? Time to buckle, okay, one thing, Knight of Earth, loyal, dedicated, honorable, and kind. Time to buckle down, get things done, honor your commitments, a guardian angel. So again, this is going to be a weekend, this is going to be a weekend, I think, for some act, for activity for you, um, Aquariuses. It's kind of like you are, um, again, it's, this continues that same type of energy. It's, you know, again, it's not like the light switch that goes on, off. It's more the dimmer switch. It's continuing. You have to buy into it, though. You have to then wake up and, you know, so you wake up on a Saturday morning and normally you sleep in and you go, no, not today. Today I'm getting up at, I'm getting up at this time and I am going to now do things, okay? So that's the type of energy that I'm seeing for this weekend. I'm feeling it's kind of, and I'm also feeling it's going to be more ambitious energy for you, too. Okay. And yet still, it's continuing. It's continuing as things change for you. Now, you have to you have to accept that, but you have to also live that out a little bit. Now, if you choose to say, you know what, no, I'm just going to stay in and, you know, watch my Netflix, that was way back. That was, what was that? And that was in, like, October, you know, the Netflix, you know, with your blankie in the corner or on the couch, you know, sucking your thumb. You're, you're been, you've been moving out of that. You've been moving out of that. But if you choose not to move out of it, then that is your choice, okay? But I am feeling ambitious energy that you can use for your benefit. Okay, this card is reversed. This one is release, okay? Archangel Azrael. And this one is the end of a phase or situation, spiritual transformation, time to move on. And that's kind of what we were just talking about. We were just talking about you have to be the one to make the decision to move on. 
you you know the energies are there the energies are saying yes this is a time now you can be ambitious you can do these things but you have to move you have to move with the energy okay you have to be the one to take the action there's that old um old joke woman's praying and you know and saying or, or man male whoever is praying oh help me win the lottery help me win the lottery oh you know and then you know going down the road and oh, I, I, I've lost everything. Help me win the lottery. I know you're there. And there's a voice that says, well, can you help me? Can you do me a favor and buy a ticket? So I'm not telling people to buy a ticket. I'm not. What I'm saying, though, is, you know, we, you, know I, you, can, you can have everything presented to you, but if you're not the one to go and open up the presents, then, you know, shame on you. Because the energies are that the universe, the divine guardian angels, higher power, spirit guides, they're, they're waiting for you to take some action, okay? And we've talked about this. This is not new, new, this is not new news for a lot of my Aquariuses. Okay, and this card is just confirming it. Release, okay? Release that negative, go to that positive. Especially, you know, we're going into that new moon. You know, this is the time, you know, you release and then from new moon to full moon you take or you ask, things like that. That's, okay, let's see what this last card says it is reversed also the eight of earth again earth energy things you can touch and feel security your home okay and this is skilled work is rewarded learning all there is to know about a topic going back to school so again this is telling me that this weekend there will be a lot of ambitious type of energy for you to work with but you have to be the one to work with it okay it's all there. It's all there. So, you know, wake up and work with the ambitious energy. It's it's there for you. Things are changing. Things are changing. Okay, my Aquariuses, as always, know that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.